friends, welcome to DP Tutorials. In this tutorial, let us learn how to create Gantt chart in Microsoft Excel. A Gantt chart is used to represent the project schedule in a graphical view. Do you know that the Gantt chart has been named after Henry Gantt? Let us learn how we can prepare a Gantt chart in Excel in an easy manner. However, there are many softwares and scheduling tools to prepare project schedule. In this tutorial, we shall be using the stack chart to generate the Gantt chart and let us see how to do this now. I am consider a simple schedule with 5 activities like this as shown in B2 to D7 having activities, target dates, and duration. Select the entire data range B2 to D7 including the heading. Go to Insert tab from the menu bar. In the Charts section, click on Horizontal 2D Stack Bar, this one. We get the chart like this. Right click on the chart area and click select data. Select data source dialog box will then appear. Click on edit button under the category of horizontal axis labels and select axis label range as B3 to B7. Click OK. Under Legend Entry Series on the left side, click on Add to add a new series. Under Series Name, type as Date and select the data range as C3 to C7. Click OK. And now ensure Date Series should be on top. On click OK. Now convert the dates into general format from the home tab in the menu bar. Click on the horizontal axis bar and click format. From the axis format dialog box, set the minimum and maximum values just before and after the first and last dates like this. In the axis options at the bottom, under number, select date as the category format. And code as DD-MMM. Click Add. So the access will be shown in the format of DD and MMM. Select the date series, this orange color. Right click Format Data Series. Under Fill Options, select No Fill. So we make them as invisible. Now as a final step, select the vertical axis and click Format Axis. Under Axis Options, select the checkbox Categories in Reverse Order. So friends, in this way you can see the Gantt chart like this. Do further formatting as per your requirement to add the cosmetic value. So friends, this is all about the Gantt chart in Excel. I hope you have enjoyed this. If yes, please do give me a like, share and comment. For further more interesting videos, please do subscribe DP Tutorials. Thank you friends. Thanks for watching.